Are you ready to move out of the farm? No, probably not. And I know you guys really love this base. You guys think this is the best base in the game, so no. You probably don't want to move out of the farm. Anyways, I'm your host, Get Good Fox, and we're playing some more State of Decay 2 in the Lethal Zone Homecoming Edition. And, yep, it's time to move out of the base. The base that's the best base, maybe, possibly. The best base in this region, for sure. And we are going to be heading out to the, this other base. What, what's this base right, called? Guys, I'm ready to get back to the game. It's called Fort Marshall. That's where we're going to be going. It is, well, it's, it's in Marshall, because it's called Fort Marshall. You know, I guess there's some, like, mysterious association there that I have not deciphered yet. But that's what we are going to be Bruh. crashing into a boulder for. So this base is kind of weird. Anything. These folks aren't friendly yet. Uh, it's the biggest base, but it's not the most expensive base. Or it's the biggest base in terms of survivor requirement. But it's not the biggest base in terms of influence cost. And I'm guessing that's intentional. I'm guessing they did that on purpose, just, you know, I guess to make it a little more unique. But, um, yeah, here we are. I believe this was the location where... Dr. Hoffman was set up on Echo Labs, I think. But I can't remember for sure. Yeah, I think this is where we went to go get her crazy lab equipment that allowed us to make the Plague Buster in the Heartland. And I see we already got zombies just rushing to, to the location to make everything a little bit harder, make it a little harder than it needs to be. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> we like compare that to heavy weapons. Like, let's get real here. Alrighty, so we are on the inside. Let's go ahead and clear it out. Goodbye. Oh, there we go. Okay, so now uh, I don't think we have to scout the. I guess the base doesn't really require much in the way of scouting, so we can just go ahead and claim it. This is what we're looking for. You need at least eight people. We've got nine, and then you need 2,000 influence. I went ahead and sold a bunch of stuff, so by stuff I mean strong painkillers. So we have 4,500. So it has a total of 16 slots. We got four parking slots. I wonder if those count towards the 16. Um, they might. Uh, we got a shooting range, clinic, cramp barracks. We will look at these uh, in a bit more, but. Uh, here's the description. Fort Marshall, a potential home site. The military transformed this football field into the front line of their war on the plague walls. They're gone now, and it seems they left a lot of stuff behind. And I guess it's our stuff now. And here we are. In our new home. Uh, let's take a look. So we got a bunch of beat-up facilities. We, of course, have our basic storage, so our storage looks like it does need to be upgraded. Let's go ahead and do that before everything self-destructs. Uh, okay, good. Looks like we're about to finish our satellite broadcast. So, um, I guess the first thing I want to do is get this cramped barracks fixed up so that we can reduce our morale penalty, maybe get back into the positives, and that will be, uh, you know, just make things go faster. So we got a cramped barracks, provides eight beds and a morale penalty. So it sounds like it's basically a built-in Spartan barracks. Let's go ahead and get that repairing. We still have more manpower, so I think the next thing we'll do is get this operational, the military clinic. Uh, a simple medical station the military set up to keep their soldiers healthy. We can upgrade this facility if we unpack the remaining equipment containers. Enables passive health recovery and removal of trauma and infection. Check survivors in to treat partial and total blood plague infection. Crafts, bandages, plague cures, produce meds. Equivalent to a level two. I wonder if we can level it up to three. If we can't, that is not pretty not good. Still got more manpower though. We got some defensive towers, a network of watchtowers with excellent sight lines and overlapping fields of fire provides some defensive benefit or a lot if we invest more ammo so let's go ahead and get that up and running um i don't know well lose use latrine boost morale as long as we can spend the labor to keep it clean okay 
These all look like they all take two, so we've got a lot of manpower, so it's, I don't know. Military shooting range increases max stamina, passively speeds up shooting and wits improvement, use labor to rapidly improve shooting or wits skills equivalent to the shooting range level two, so I guess this is um, a level two shooting range if you don't need to switch into a sheriff as your leader, as well as I guess you have the benefit of all of it being pre-constructed. So let's go ahead and take a look outside at our base. Heading out. Don't mess with my stuff while I'm gone. And, um... Let's jump up here and get a view. Oh, this is the... Let's, let's get our... Let's go ahead, right off the bat, let's go ahead and pick up our screenshot real quick. This is going to be the scene of our new base. Um... Can't say... I, I, I mean... I got to admit that not, this isn't really like you, you can't really tell what you're looking at. Like maybe I need to pan down a little bit. So one thing I've right off the bat is that up close, at least the base isn't all that. It's kind of nondescript looking, but let's take a look at the wall. See how defensively formidable this base is going to be. Got ourselves a normal entrance here. Doesn't look like we can jump up over here anywhere. So that's fine. Uh, this is obviously way, what does this say? F. P, Con, Delta, do not approach with weapon. You will be fired upon. Well, does that mean the zombies get to approach because they don't have weapons? Like, seems like a really dumb policy. Like, no wonder the army got owned. Um, yeah, I don't think we can jump up any of this area. Oh, this is crap, must be one of the shooting powers. Screamer. I don't think we can climb anywhere up here. Interesting, it terminates into, or I didn't terminate, but rather it just takes a very tight turn around this bathroom, and I don't think we can climb anywhere up there. Here's another normal entrance. Thought the zombies were after me. Oh, so this guy looks like he was goofing off, like trying to like do monkey bars or something and died. Kind of an embarrassing way to go, gotta say. Uh, this base looks pretty secure. Like, I, I'm not really seeing any area that we can go in. What, what about here? Can we, like, Mario our way up this? I have a strong feeling we cannot. Can I, like, am I stuck? Okay, that's fine. We can just go right down here and use our unstuck command. Or stuck command. I can't. I, I don't know. Some games call it unstick. Unstuck. It, it just varies from game to game. Yeah, I don't think that this can... I don't think that there's any way up besides the doors. What about here? Uh-oh. Oh, man. Nope. Wait, oh. I can't climb up that. Yeah, I don't think I can climb up this. Yeah, I think I don't think we can climb up that. Um, yeah, so there you go. That is the exterior of the base. I guess we can tour the inside. Let's make some more storage space before we start losing stuff. Uh, let's also get more stuff going. So we also have yeah, this down do here. It. A mobile catering station, originally designed to feed a large crowd of hungry soldiers quickly and cheaply, affects morale and stamina, manages rationing, crafts, fatigue-removing consumables, can produce food, adds a solar array facility to your base to accelerate its actions, equivalent to a kitchen level two with some extra, so is it like super extra good? So this looks like it's just a latrine, which means it's worse than the one in um, the, the pterodactyl park, because the, the pterodactyl park also had beds so this here is bed maybe I, I can't remember how many um how much morale you lose on the spartan barracks i can't remember if it's th three or five but it's very similar to a spartan barracks uh we can put one of these in to make it a little bit better uh we can go ahead and upgrade this probably in the fire safe um oh so okay it looks like Okay, so it looks like we can upgrade to the military clinic. So that was really confusing because military clinic two, infirmary level three, but military clinic level two is equal to uh, infirmary level three. It says it right there. Uh, unpack the extra medical equipment the military left behind to expand the facility's okay, usefulness, making equivalent now. to an infirmary level three. Fuck why? The like what? Oh. 
Uh, where is my exploder onies at? Oh yeah, that's right. It's right. It, this, this one has a pretty conveniently located. Is somebody out there? I'll just throw one on the door. Oh my god, it's right. It's right. Up, it's like dead set. Dead center. I spotted a feral. Don't even try it. He's stuck, like the body's blocking him. You think we got him all? Oh god, he's setting me on fire! Oh! Come on, you guys are letting him inside. There's another juggernaut in here. What are you guys doing? Do you guys not see the juggernaut in here? It's not a trick question. Can, can you shoot him? Oh, thank you. Yeah, I was about to say, he's, I know he's a really hard target to hit. Oh, very smart. That's a good idea. You want to... You know what's a good idea? You got the 50 caliber and you start using the knife. That seems like a really smart idea. Okay. I should probably do something about the screamer, shouldn't I? Now you guys are oh it's like what did you not take it seriously earlier? Every survivor I see is like a fucking gift. Oh my god. I just want the loot. I don't want to open the door. I want the loot. There's some stank in that one. Oh my god, I'm so sick of these like door-to-door -door salesmen. I don't want any. Are those is that a plague horde? Or a armored horde? Looks like it. There we go. That's the end of them. It's all over. Okay, anyways. Now I can pick this up, clean up the base, and we can get back over here. So this says it adds another treatment bed. Uh, the pharmacology can make even stronger painkillers, increase the benefit of surgery and pathology. So it looks like it's just a level, a, a, the next level clinic. Why, why do I feel massive vibrations? Like it feels like there's another juggernaut here. But there's not. All right, so it looks like this is just a level three infirmary. This is basically a start art and barracks. This is... I don't see anything different about it. it. Looks like it's basically just a kitchen. Um, I mean... It, 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 okay, so you even lose materials per day. A lot of built-in facilities have the benefit of not costing material. But it costs material, so it's... It is basically... I don't see any difference between it and just having... A kitchen. I guess I'll put this in it. Um, so this is just a normal everyday, even though it's like defensive towers, like with an S at the end, so you would think that that would mean it would be different, but it's really not. Like, all of these abilities are exactly what you would expect. So here's what we know what we want. We know we definitely want a Red Town workshop. Um, we already have a clinic. So what are we going to put inside? Well, I think... What is our current leader? You are a builder? Well, I don't think I want... I... I think I'm going to go with... A lounge? I don't know what I want in that other building slot, though. Um... I guess I'm going to put the officer's quarters here? I can always change my mind later, like nothing stops me from doing it. And the last one's gonna be, of course, the trade depot. So let's go ahead and knock this character out and change leaders. Demote. No, no dialogue? You can't hack it, but what would you say to letting someone else lead for a bit? 
right. But I don't envy whoever's next to me for this job. Well, we already know who's next. It's well, it's whoever the bill whoever our trader is. Hannah? Why are you clutching your like arm? Like what's wrong with you? Where are you? Like, what is wrong with you? Like why are you acting like you're all beat up? You're not even that Stop being a wimp. Oh, or it could be Sean. Let me see if there's a relevant difference between them. Like, if one of them has better standing. So you both have meal done plan. And done. Um, it looks like it kind of doesn't matter which one we choose. That said, um, I would prefer to play as Hannah. I like her skills better. So if we want to demote her, I, I get to play as a character I prefer more. So let's go ahead and do that. And now we can go ahead and set up the trade depot. Which we're going to have to, like, switch anyways, because we'll, we'll need the sheriff to get to the level 3 lounge. So that's something that we would need anyways. Let's go ahead and add in the white noise machine back to Rodriguez. Um, do we want to... I don't think there's any more mods to plug in. Oh, yeah, we can put in the fireworks station there. We can put in, let's put in the stabilizing foam here for now. Like these guys are just constantly shooting. Like there must just be like an unending supply of zombies in the general area. Okay. Yeah, look at this. These defensive towers, like you're just letting them off. What is the point of these defensive towers? Why are you, look, are you gonna let are you gonna let this guy go in the base? Shoot him! Are you gonna let that guy get in the base? Shoot him! Look at him! He's getting in the he's he's wasting his oh oh they're gonna get him. Okay. Okay, they got him. I'm I'm just saying like are, are, I mean, there, are we supposed to have like overlapping fields of like, you know, fancy like military jargon stuff? Like I'm, I'm just feeling like, you know, I'm feeling a little bit let down. Oh, so, it, I know what we're going to do next. We've got some people who apparently are unsatisfied with Fox's leadership. You know what that means. You know what happens when people are not satisfied. Not it means I need to, you know, craft a few interesting items. And then um, I got to I gotta pay him a bit of a visit. That's right. We got to mosey on down there. And, um, let me see. I think that's good enough. I think that's okay. Oh, let me take a med kit. Just, just in case my face gets blasted in twain, that I, I am able to, like, fix my face back together. I will see you when I'm there, though. I'm going to wait for the 30 seconds for the stabilizing foam so I can, like, be a cheapskate and get my free heal real quick. All right, so if you remember, these were the guys who are the grump. Oh, it's perfect. We even have a feral. There should only be one of them left. Unless they're cheating. Okay, I, I gotta get in there. Oh, that sucks. I gotta deny the quest. I need to deny- I need to get my money. I need to get my money. Quickly, I must deny the quest. Where is he? No! You can't die yet! I mean, you, you, you literally can, but give me my money first! Can I talk you through the door? Hey, I, do you want to give me the money before you go? I, I really would like the money. Why is he attacking me? I didn't do anything. Hey, I, I need the money. Give me the money. Look at this guy. I just need to, like, get far enough away from him. And then it'll be fine. It's getting worse! I'll never get my money back! Oh, no! He's taking his money to the grave with him. Oh, well. I can extract it from his, like, body, like, whatever items he provides. Yep. 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 Zombies, we gotta burn them, you know, we gotta do things. How have we not burned those guys? Okay, let's see what items this guy had on. 
Um, oh, the World War One bayonet would actually, that actually should sell for a little bit. I think that's actually considered kind of like a, you know, a fairly, you know, maybe not a rare weapon, but a, you know, I think it's just considered a weapon that's worth a decent bit as a seller. Maybe it's like a collector's item or something like that. But yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, I would have preferred if we could deny the quest, because I think he would have given us another 200 if we denied the quest, but, um, I have no idea what there's nothing we can do. Oh, yeah, we're going up here because apparently there's, like, more grumpy butts who, like, are not satisfied with my leadership. I don't know why. I'm going so far out of my way in order to, like, help people and make them like me. But these... Really? Is that, is that like, aircraft landing gear specifically blocking me so I can't weave my way through this? Thank you. Thank you. Alrighty, taking a shortcut through the Oasis, and it looks like these guys who are unhappy with us, they're known as the Survivors. Well, you know, I, I'm, I'm going to put that to the test. Like, uh, you know, I don't know. I, I think claims of being the Survivors, like, what if you don't survive? Like, that's, uh, you know, I'm pretty sure we could have a lawsuit for false advertising there, so, hmm. Let's find out, run out of that soon. The scent lock is on. Oh, perfect. This is the perfect thing. Nani? Oh, God. Ah, oh, man. Get away. No, you don't. What is this guy doing? Leave me alone. Okay, I didn't have this on. Oh, what hit me? That is so many zombies. I'm gonna Sonic the Hedgehog my way a little closer. Oh god! I see. But I'd love to get. I'd love to find the. Wait, 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 I got an idea. The car. Of course. The car is the answer. I'll just shine the light. Wait, that's not my car. Where is my car? Would you guys want some more zombie? Oh god! He hit me! You jerk! Would you guys want some more zombie? Oh god! Why would you do it? Here we go. Here we go. Um, wow, I still can't even see what's going on in there. Look at, there are so many zombies in there. I mean, I can't see anything. But according to the map, there are so many zombies in there. I, we got, like, Armored Bob over here who's just kind of, like, clueless. He's looking for the action, but he can't find any. Well, we, one of them went down. There we go. Oh, there we go. You guys doing okay in there? I, oh, God. He doesn't know it's me, though, so it's all good. This is, like... It's like a news report. I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get, like, the good footage for you guys. I, I see what they're doing. They're trying to, to divide the zombies up. Like, I'll go outside of the base and behind the fence. That way, like, it splits the quantity of the zombies' numbers up. I mean, for her, it seems to be working pretty well. Like, oh yeah, for him, it's really not. It's not. It's definitely not like, going like too well for him. I gotta say. She's like, is she abandoning the base? The ferals are like really not. Oh god. Oh god. Oh man. Why would you do that? That's it. This entire area must be purged. I need my money. Like those guys, they owe, they owed me like 20 bucks. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna get up here. Give me a good, 
allow me to like saturate the entire area. One day at a time. That's how we're gonna get through. Yep. One day at a time. Yep. Oh, you want it? Is that what it is? You want some of this? There you go. Wow, that cleared him out efficiently. I, I, I was expecting a little more than that, I, I got to admit. Okay, let's see what we got here. Now I can extract my just rewards. Taxahawk, um, a trench gun, we got a knife and a backpack. Let's go ahead and just throw that in the back of here. And let Ryan, bam, bam, bam. Let's go ahead and throw some of these in there. That way it'll just try to throw some things in that'll stack up. Um, let me go ahead and just get my little bit of influence for taking this guy out as well. Okay, so we know one of them went outside. Another one was over here. Oh, the problem is, yeah, I don't know. Okay, so this one got, must have got taken out by the feral because they, they don't have a head. Or they could have turned into a zombie. And that, what, let me check the color. No, they still have, like, human-colored flesh, so... They probably got executed by a feral, which does cause your head to explode. These are still close. Okay, let me get this last guy. And I assume one of them went down in here. In this place. But at the same time, they could have become a zombie and wandered off with my loot. And if they wandered off with my loot, who knows where they went? All right, where could they be? It's not you. I already took all of my stuff from you. Let's go check this gigantic mass of, like... Ah! Aha! Oh, man, we hit the jackpot here. We've got an AR-15. Doesn't matter that it's damaged. It's still going to sell for, like, a good amount of money. I think, like, I think about 115. A branding iron, we can probably scrap that. Um... Let's throw some of this in the car. And that'll be an okay haul. We'll have completed all of that. Oh, we can't do that. Um, are there any pistols that I can... Wait, do we need to refuel? Hey, we might be able to finagle some of our inventory. Bruh. Oh. <sighs> well, at least now... I can get out of my car efficiently. So the Pharaoh thinks that he's, he's inconvenienced me. He, he's only made me more efficient. And now we can get the... Go reduce our efficiency by reattaching the door. And I think that will bring an end to our little adventure today. I think we did, did pretty good stuff. Let's go ahead home and see if there's anything else we want to do to the base before we wrap things up. All right, so one thing I got to say is I like the parking spaces. They're all, all of them are right in a group together. That's the way I like it. I don't like it when the parking spaces are like divided up. I want them all to be basically next to each other. This isn't quite next to each other, but it's close enough. All right, let's get, uh, actually, uh, this looks like a decent, yeah, I'm gonna get on top really of one of my you. vans as my command perch. Right, I said get on the van. Okay, let's see if there's anything else that we would wanna do with the base. Um, swab the poop deck, no, I think it's fine. We can do, whoops. Let's go ahead and get this upgrading. Um, I don't think there's, it doesn't really matter, we're not really using that. Um, this would be good for a comfy chair, that's no, that's a no, this is fine. Is it, yes, it is going to give me the 50%, but um, yeah, I think that's about it. Let's go ahead and demote Hannah. And let's go ahead and get our sheriff leader. Might as well get all of that. Just get it all done in a clean sweep. That means we're going to be definitely be playing as um, Hannah because we're going to lose our food bonus. I think I've tracked the person who found my mace to a few possible places. I don't want to find your mace. I really don't. Oh, my God. 
Okay, that's fine. saying you can't hack it, but what would you say to letting someone else lead for a bit? I guess I'd have to agree. Leading this team isn't easy. Yeah, for like all of like, what, like 20 minutes? Okay, so let's go get our sheriff who is going to be Marin? Not Rodriguez, that's for sure. Yeah, so it's going to be Marin, absolutely. We don't want to use any red talons because they take a standing penalty and it takes forever to get them back up to speed. And that means uh, we should be able to upgrade this to max, and then this base will be essentially I'm good, fully I'm maxed good. out. We will need to re-level our guys up, so that means we'll need to re-level up Hannah and... Um, you are like a temporary hire. Once we upgrade the base, you're getting kicked out anyways. Um, and that's because construction does... I thought construction let you build... I don't even remember. Maybe we can kick you out now. Yeah, I'm just going to kick you out right now if, if apparently construction doesn't speed up our labor naturally. Thank you for your contributions. Oh, Arctic Warrior, that sells for a good bit. I'm even going to take your little K-bar and replace it with a dinky little chef's knife. So Anyone you're going to kick you out training? and the other character... Oh, someone want to know what his hero bonus is going to be? It's going to be responsibility, which is plus one labor. Uh, definitely one of the weaker ones that it could have been just because... You know, we don't really need labor at this stage of the game. Oh, unfortunately, we got to level up Southie. That's what it is. Okay, let's go ahead and get Southland out of here. Why? Why can't I mark you? Did I already... Is it because... Oh, somebody... I noted the problem is... Um, taking control of Kib. Somebody wants to talk to her. I bet that's the issue. So if we play as Kib, I, gotta get moving on I probably need to talk to somebody. Mm -hmm. Why can't I switch to South? Okay. For some reason, now we can switch to her. Now we can kick her out. There we go. Where are you? Good to see you. The old kickeroni? It's not you, it's us. It's definitely. You really have to leave. You do I can't definitely. You're have to leave. kicking me out. To leave it. Okay, I think that's gonna do it though. Thanks for watching. We are in the final base, which means you know, yeah, the, the series is winding down. We do have a few things that I want to do, uh, including I do want to find all of the rare weapon cases. But uh, yeah, until next time, thank you for watching. Like the video if it was entertaining. Subscribe for future State K2 content, and of course, remember that you don't have to be good to get good. Thank you.